Hi, this is size 10 straight shank hook and thread I'm using is block 8 -0. I'm going to start just below the eye just go a few millimeter up and then back again, back down again I'm going to art beard, uh, you probably saw my video how to do beard on the old box so if you want to watch that one I uploaded a few months, a couple of months ago so this is uh, actually I'm using a pheasant body feather they are just below the wings and they are very nice um, stiff feather um, you can use cock cock or any, any other you know feather but this is dyed red so I'm going to take just a few strand level the tips and then if you just put them pinch and loop you turn and if you want to alter the length just pull them down a little bit and lift them up and I will take this extra off now touch and turn <coughs> Okay, I'm going to be adding the same feather for the tail, so just a few, not too many. I don't want the tail to be too bushy. So, just a little bit longer than body length. That's fine. Now, um, for the body, I'm going to be using a black organza ribbon, and I have already cut this. You can watch me tying organza buzzer, and I, uh, you can see me cutting this. How to cut this? So, and um, as you can see, this is cut like diagonally. So and then you cut this from there to create a little point touch and turn keep coming and just take this extra piece off all the way now just to work with the body actually if it's not a level body then you can just kind of you know use a level it up and I'm going to add a flashback which is a red holographic tinsel and I've already taken the piece off so just put that on top and then make sure you just catch it right on the top once it sits nicely and then you just kind of Secure this all the way. And then you can check if that's okay. Yep. Now the best way is to come back and then as you can see there's a little depth here so just level that up. Just and the body is uneven so I'm gonna work with the body and then that looks okay all the way back to the eye now here what you have to do is you need a little bit of super glue If you put 
will switch to super glue onto the holographic tin. So it's just to hold the position on top of the hook. So I'll just show you. Now if you could kind of stretch this. If you get it on top nicely, it's fine. And then make sure it sits and then you cut this extra piece off. And all you have to do is just bring your so he just stuck to my hand. Right, now let's bring your organza. So just one turn behind and then one in the front. I need to leave a little gap so we can we can see the holographic tin so now once you're done that, nicely secure this, you turn and then cut this piece off. Now you can see all these fibers sticking forward, just hold them back and then kind of catch them and secure. This tail is going just a bit funny. Now, if you turn this upside down and use your thumbnail for like an under beard and then stroke it down and then catch it with the same thread and then go back to the normal position and form the head. nice and neat head and basically just how we finish then you can work with your tail and body after but like I said you know I'm just gonna get this fluff off from the front all you need is a varnish to finish off. So there we have Organza Delba. Thank you very much for watching.